Get it while it's hot. The dude mung is 3,000. No monkey. Dude, you do that. Say what up, it's your boy Dude Mungus. Uh, it is late today, but anyway, I had a, a package come in today. I had some new grips come in today. My old dripping grips are getting uh, they're getting kind of worn out, and also this is going to be part of my track day prep. Um, so it's a real simple job. No you need a 12 millimeter socket. Like I have, I don't know if these are, uh, I don't know if these are stock. Um, bar ends, but I need a 12 millimeter uh, hex key to get in there. Um, definitely gonna need some hairspray, um, something to cut the old grips off. Um, and also, these are my domino grips that I got. Um, your eyes are not fooling you. I have a red one and a yellow one. I did that legit on purpose. <laughs> so, heck yeah. Also, man, um, Shout out to my guy Damien, man. My parts guy Damien, dude. He always hooks me up. Always makes sure dead shot stays on the scrum diddles. I'm just saying, you gonna buy parts anyway. You might as well save yourself some money, bro. Like you're legit. Like, oh, if you're looking at something, you're gonna buy it regardless, dude. Save some money. Hit up my guy. I have his information in the description. Hit him up. You will not be disappointed. Honestly, if it wasn't for God allowing me to meet this man, I wouldn't have half the stuff I have on dead shot. But this bro, this dude gives me. He, man, he gives me good deals, man. These are the best prices I've ever found. But anyway, uh, we're gonna start with the throttle side. Because uh, I think it's the most difficult. The other side is just real easy. But this side with the throttle tube is the most difficult. So we're just gonna start with this side. But anyway, let me get the camera set up and then we'll get, we'll get to going. And I have these little metal pieces on the end, so I'm not for sure how difficult that's gonna make getting, the, getting everything off, but we'll, we'll see when we get there. Here, I'm just gonna take this little metal piece off right there. All right, now I'm gonna get my trusty dusty knife. I'm just gonna slice it. Some people use compressed air, which is a really good way to do it with compressed air. Um, uh, but I ain't using it. Cut it and then we'll slip this off. Get this little ring off. There we go. Back out. Now it's off. Uh, that would have went a lot easier had not I had these little metal rings on there. Now we're going to dip into the hairspray. I just got regular hairspray. Nothing like fancy dancy or nothing super duper special. Just cleaning this surface off. Open the package. Got the yellow. Oh, that's gonna look good. And then we got the uh, red for the other side. Oh, heck yeah. Just gonna spray a little bit in the shaft here. And then spray a little bit on this. Just to make it easy to get on. Oh, getting over this lip is like the most difficult part. Once you get over this lip, it it goes to easy peasy lemon squeezy. It's just literally getting past this lip. Makes it a little difficult because I still don't have my full right hand strength back. I'm using this hairspray, it's gonna give me enough wiggle room before it dries that I can uh, get it placed exactly where I want it to be. And again, the throttle side is the most difficult. You get the throttle side, the other side is gonna be like legit cake work. I think we got it. And also when you get done, you wanna make sure you got good crisp movement. Bam, that's it. Nice, clean, crisp movement. It feels good. All right, on to the other side. All right, uh, it's gonna be the same process. Uh, it's legit the same process on this other side. Okay, um, this is a really simple job, but I just wanna take you guys along with everything I'm doing to get prepared for this track day. So something that I've been wanting to do is uh, change out these foot pegs. Now I've already changed out these foot pegs once, 
um, but still, uh, these foot pegs, they were like a, I forget where I got them from, but they're kind of a little jagged on the edge. Um, so what I did is I ordered some, uh, ordered some OEM, uh, foot pegs from the Ducati V4, uh, Pentagali V2 and the 1299. Now the ones that came stock on the bike were absolutely horrible. And that's why I ended up switching to these. Uh, I, this is probably like the third or fourth foot peg I'm trying. Um, but I've been on the 1299, I've been on the V2 and I've been on the V4 and I absolutely love the way these feel. So I'm going to go with these. I probably honestly legit should have just invested in a pair of, uh, of rear sets, but I've just never thought to go that deep into it. But I think I might be finding out that it's pretty daggum important. But anyway, so we're going to swap these out and then we're going to take it for a ride um, to see how they feel. And like I said, this really won't be a long video. Yeah, really simple. Uh, it has like a clip behind here. You pop this clip out, pop that bolt out, and you're literally is done. So I'll take y'all along for the first uh, one, but I won't show the other side because there's really no need to. I got my little pick. I'm just going to pick this clip out. Like I said, guys, this is a real, real easy job. I'm not even grabbing my glove for this. Clip is out. I'm just going to push this pin through uh, so I can get through the other side. Just take a little pressure off by leaning it up. Just press that through like that. And then I'll use this other end of this flat end just to uh, get it the rest of the way through. And I hope that picks up on camera. But yeah, that's pretty much it. I mean, super stupid simple. Uh, it's a way to do the job if you didn't want to uh, invest in some rear sets. Uh, I'm getting stupid excited for this track day. I am, I am like freaking, I'm freaking stoked, man. <laughs> I am excited. Track day is August 21st and 22nd. The 20th, which is a Friday, is for the advanced people only. Your boy Mungus definitely is not advanced. Um, but yeah, man, I'm, I'm excited. This will be my first track day, and it's going to be with Deadshot, and it's going to be on my favorite track road atlanta well my favorite track video game wise <laughs> i'm not going crazy just wiped it down a little bit and then i'm gonna throw some grease on there just to make sure the operation stays uh make sure the operation stays pretty smooth and like and like i know this is a really simple upgrade some of you guys you know this might be light work you know to you guys but it's a little stuff like this that uh that makes me fall in love with that shot and little stuff like this that's gonna make the difference make sure my operation is okay seems like it is yep so now that's in there I'm just gonna insert the clip back in and uh, should be good to go and that's it have an operation of a new foot pack and like I said I'm gonna do the other side but I'm not gonna make you guys sit and wait for that so yeah it seems like this one sticks out just a little bit further than the other one if you can see just just the hair Looks like a Thank you for watching, dude. No monkey. No monkey. Thank you for watching, dude. No monkey. Look, I can move now.